Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I know I have not posted in a really long time and I am so sorry. Um, that's because I got a new phone and also I've been taking violin classes now. Yes, I've always wanted to take violin classes and I have it now. So what we're going to be doing today is that as you guys can read the title, we are going to be learning how to play the violin for beginners and then I could like help you build it more up, up, up. So that's what we're gonna do. And one quick little start. If your violin has really light rosin, which is the rosin comes in this little thing. Well, this is how mine comes in. And it's like some kind of thing and you're supposed to cut it and then powder comes in. If it's light rosin, then it will not make sound. And this video might not be for you guys, but I would recommend you guys to go to Hensa's Music Center because they have black rosin there. And that's why you need black rosin to make your violin make noise. If you guys don't have black rosin, I am so sorry, but this video is not for you guys. Maybe another time we could, you guys could watch this video over again and that is fine. And second notification is that I'm going to be using my violin school book. I'm going to be using Suzuki book volume one. And, and if you guys do have rosin, but you guys don't know how to do this, or if you guys don't have school, it's totally fine. You guys could take classes here because, um, that's kind of what my thing is now. So, uh, just ignore this. So, we're going to start with pepperoni pizza. If you guys do not know what a one is, let me bring up this violin here. So, my teacher, we could not see, she put in tapes. We're not going to be using this tape today. That's going to be for the future. I don't know when, but someday. And I'm going to teach you guys how the notes work. So, the, this is a G note, yeah. And this is the D note and this is an A note and this is the E note so this is the E note all the way at the bottom I don't know if yours has a number but mine says 95 and where, the, where your number is right there is the E string and this tape is where E1 E2 and E3 like that look how it sounds and this is how the bow and this is E where the number is, and this is how it's supposed to sound without touching anything. That's how it's supposed to sound. If it says E1, then then you look where the first, this is where the first tape is, is that's where you're gonna put your finger. Right there, and this is how it sounds next. And then we're gonna move on to E2 which is a little bit more further away and make sure your finger is on the tape that way it can fully make the sound like this and E3 which is right next door okay now we're gonna move on oh, sorry guys now we're gonna move on to the A note the A note is the one on top of the E and this one's E and this one is A. It's supposed to sound like this. Listen, guys. Okay. So, um, this is how the A sounds like. I might also play another note, but I'll just retry it. That's how it's supposed to sound like, okay? So, now, if we come here, when it says A1, make sure it's fully on the tape like mine. Okay. This is how it's going to sound like. And now, if you guys could see that there's a second tape, that's where you're going to put the other finger. Oh, wait, my bad. I am so sorry. I played the wrong note. One more time. And then A3, which is right a little bit further space like that. Okay. If it did not sound like that, go tell, um, it might be untuned, and I don't know how to tune my violin. My teacher helps me tune it for me, but at least it's supposed to sound like this. 
and this is backwards. Okay. So now that you guys got the whole concept of everything, how my teacher taught me is pepperoni pizza style. So this is how you guys are going to sound like for the E one. The one with the number on it, like this. That is how we're going to do it. And now that you guys know we're E1, E2, and E3, that is good because that is the notes that we're going to be using. So now if I could turn to page number 25, if you guys do not have Suzuki book, that is fine. You guys could look off mine. This is what we're going to do. Do not block the star since I already passed it. It's totally fine. Um, but we're only going to do two songs and they're going to be the same. So, um, I just don't want to make this video really long for you guys. So this is how it's going to go. If you guys cannot see it properly, I'll read it to you guys and make sure you guys grab a pen and paper or pencil and paper. The first one is A, write A on your paper. The other one is an E, an E. The first one is E1, E1. Make sure it's a 1, E with a 1. Then it's just plain E. Then we're going to go to 3A, 3A. Then 2A, 1A, and just A. And then we're going to move on to a, a single E, just E. 3A, 2A, and 1A. And then E. And then we're going to move on to 3A, 2A, 1A, A. And then we're going to go to E, 1E, E, sorry, 3A, 2A, 1A, and A. That is how we're going to do it. And this is how it's supposed to look. It might look opposite, but that's how it looks. All right. So I'm going to put it right here. And how we're going to do it is pepperoni pizza style. So I hope you guys wrote it down. And you guys could look at your paper. And right there you could copy what I'm doing. But pepperoni pizza style. Okay. So this is how it's going to go guys. Grab your violin. Pepperoni pizza on A. E1, 1, just E, now 3A, 2A, 1A, and just A. if you guys caught that good job you guys made the first song and that was called twinkle twinkle little star pepperoni pizza style so since i passed that my teacher gave me a star and um yeah so that now we're gonna move on to our second 
song is also Twinkle Twinkle Little Star, but this one's called Theme. And I'm not going to jump into the D-A-G-D. That one's going to be a little bit more confusing, so I'm going to move on um, in the future also. But this one is more different. So if you guys have another pen and paper, go ahead and grab it. We're not looking at this one. We're looking at this one right now. This is how it goes if you guys could copy it. It's going to go like that since it's opposite. So yeah, that's how it actually goes. So like that way. Here's a couple. Mm -hmm. If you guys cannot see that, that is totally fine. You guys could stop, rewind, and pause the video and copy it down. If you guys did not have a chance and if you guys have like a rush, I'll repeat it for you guys. It is two A's, two E's. One E of two of them. One E, one E. An E of two, three A's. Two, two A's. Two one A's. And one A. Two E's. Three A's. I mean, no, no, no. No three A's. Two three A's. Two... Two A's, one A, E, E, three A, three A, two A, two A, one A, A, E, one A, E, E, three A, three A, three A, two A, two A, one A, one A, A. If you guys did not see that, you could rewind the video and pause it. Here is another glance. It's going to go that way since it's opposite. So write it down that way. Here it is. If you guys cannot see it. Okay. If you guys did not catch that, that is fine. You could uh, rewind and go pause the video to that. And let's play it. Okay, so here we go. Two A's with no fingers on it. Now E, two of them. One E. And one really long E, but it's only one, like this. Three A. Two A. 1A and one long A. E, 3A, 2A, and one long A. Two E's, 3A, 2A, one long A. And A. E. One E. And one long E. Three A. Two A. One A. And an A. Um, just because that one is a little bit more harder, I'm going to repeat it, but I'm going to do it more faster. And one last time. This this is how it goes, but fast. That's how it sounds like, but one day you guys will be really, really good. And next time we'll do two more songs. And that was all for this video. And 
remember it was the Suzuki book volume one and that was all for the YouTube video don't forget to like comment subscribe turn on notifications that way you guys know when I post a brand new video I post every single Friday Saturday Monday and Wednesdays so that's when I'm gonna post um so just stay happy believe in yourself if you guys did not make this go rewind back the video and watch it over again um but that was our video and I hope I'll see you guys tomorrow bye guys bye